I've been mustering about this game. This may be say like it could it could have done a little bit more, but while I have another idea for another DLC, and this end up calling it the non-stealth DLC, or should we call it a not so stealth DLC? Not so stealthy. Naming this in progress, but we're trying to get something that's not stealth or stealth at the same time. But what's up everyone? My name is Trey World Order or Shay by the way. And I'm here to say very hungry by the way on Grand Ball 5. And my voice is seriously cracking up. But to the fact is that I came up with some sort of DLC, round DLC out of my head, and this could have been worth it. I mean funny, but sorry to hear like my mic going around in the background. That's where you're annoying in, in the video. But here's the thing we're gonna break down the this DLC. I mean this is not that kind of soon, but if they ever look at this video and say, yeah, maybe we can do that. Or and I'm looking at this and say, no we can't. Then this would be a good idea. I mean here's the thing. What will be included in this DLC? I mean I believe in consciousness below or the story images, something on your screen to talk about it. Will be something that I would like to see. I mean, if it was possible, but it's also an idea. But in this case, let's get to it. And basically in Grand Hall 5, you already know who that you, know, you have suppressors in your weapon. As in you can buy stealth at buy stealth. Buy suppressors at ammunition, in which I think it costed about two thousand or three thousand. Depending on what excuse me, what gun you have. It can be assault. Like a big weapon big weapon as an assault. A big weapon like an LMG or a heavy machine gun. Or a small weapon like a you know a PP size gun, handgun, pistol, revolver, or in this case a not for grenade launchers, but also for but also for shotgun as well too. In this case, it depends. But while we add another suppressor type towards the scheme as well too, in this case, a design type. Now, you already know, if you're familiar from the Army of Two, the 40th day, then here's the thing. If you already know what I'm about to say, then I bet you can piss off. Why don't they add can suppressors towards the gun? In this case, it's like bringing in a little bit of style, but also another way of saying, okay, we can use this. I mean, this is half price, right? Yes. The gun can be also half price. Depending on what gun type of gun you're using, it can be the same it can be half of the same price that you would get for a regular suppressor. Now the difference is that the can well it could possibly make a noise if you're firing out of a you know LMG, SMG, AR, or a shotgun. It depends. I mean depending on what type of gun you're trying to buy it for, it will be a half price, one. And two, it will make a sound on as in a can sound where you're trying a can. That's what it will sound like. Or you can add like styles to it as well too. That could be one. That could be soda ammunition. Or in this case, that no idea would be making your own suppressor. I mean, I mean not making your own, but yeah, matter of fact, scratch off making your own because then it'll be like too creative in Grand Photo, if I can say, as in creating your own stuff by your hands. Get what I'm saying? But anyway, moving on to the next one. Also, like the fact is that you do have a can, but can you also buy it with style? Now, what do I mean by style? Like, I'm saying like camo reason. Like, you can add camo or final source your suppressor. I mean, pick it up, pick a color or tint towards the suppressor. Or like, for example, let's say I want to put a sprite tint in my suppressor. Or in this case, in ground four five terms, a sprunk tint towards my suppressor. Like, add a sprunk tint. Or something else on there, like peppy cola or what's or anything else. Then that could be applied on there. On there as well too, but that'll be like an extra, a extra thousand or extra five hundred, or in this case, on like half price where you buy original tents, if I can say. But basically, that can be like a little bit of time to implement this in Grand Fall Five. But that's like something I would like to see happen. I mean, come on, people, you know, those are like a little bit expensive, but you do want to buy them just go stealthy reasons why. The next one will be a bow suit. And in this case, if you don't know what bow suit is, look it up. And here's the image right about now, and. Bow suit will be looking like this. This is where I say the not so stealthy DLC, and this is why we call it like this. The reason why we can make it like this because I mean, come on, people. If you have a bubble suit on, I mean, happy Halloween, people. Then you'll be saying, okay, why am I wearing this bubble suit on? Because it's funny. I mean, here's the thing. I mean, it's not so stealthy. You're walking around with it. People are gonna be laughing. But if you had a chance to like implement the sound where if you're stepping on your bow suit, then the fact is that you're gonna be causing noise, a popping noise. Like how you, every time you're using the microphone, you're making a pop noise. Sometimes you say the word P, 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 P. Yeah, that noise. Then you were gonna be annoyed like heck, saying, "Who's making that popping noise? Come on, man!" But yeah, something like that. I mean, that could be helpful. But come on, that could be really something different. Or you take out the popping noise and just leave the pop the bow suit just like that and be walking around with it and just want to swag down people. Just kidding. But yeah, Bosu, come on. 
it can be in there. I mean, random things are always in Grand Hall 5, but random things are not always seen every day, if you get what I'm saying. Next clothing situation will be the stealth suit. In this case, for non stealthy seals DLC, it can be a stealth suit. Now, if you notice the, like, I can show you an image up on your screen showing the stealth suit. It could be something like Snake, the Snake stealth suit, as if you've seen Metal Gear Solid 4, 3, or 5. Matter of fact, I'm waiting for the next second, the second version of 5 to come out in December, in which I'm very pissed off at. But let's get back to the topic today. The self suit, the self suit they seen Snake wear, or another self suit they seen like Cobra wearing, or another self suit in which you can see in other movies, trailers, something else. It doesn't matter what color, it doesn't matter what type, it can be a hoodie as well too. Or you can create your own self suit by creating like this, a hoodie and pants, that would be really weird, but of course, like that. But a funny self suit would be like helpful to you know, for you to experience and see. But that could be one way of seeing it in the whole game in the DLC. I mean, right? A self suit? I mean, if there already was a self suit, then I wouldn't be making this video. If there was, then was said, okay, yes, finally a self suit. Yes, we can use this in any place. This does not mean this can help us go self mode and hit anyone else. If you get what I'm saying. But yeah, this could be like something fun or variation, more variation to add on Grand Fall 5 to make it look funny or be creative, as in not too creative, but yeah, creative to say, okay, it's time to go stealth, stealth, Jason Statham. But something like that, we can really want to see that. Last thing is was something that I forgot, but I really forgot what it was, but I probably will tell you sooner or later, I'm not sure. But guys, what do you think about this stealthy DLC? I'm sorry I had to break it down to you so many times. Someone came out of my head. We want to be helpful for your commentary today, like daily for your milkshake. But anyway, guys, what do you think about this daily, daily, this non-stealth DLC? Where I'm gonna name it on in the YouTube title? What do you think about it in the comments section below? What do you think? If you did enjoy the video or did enjoy this DLC idea, then press the like button. Then if you know what's going on, subscribe button. And I will see you guys later. Remember, <laughs> it doesn't take two seconds to hit that like button, or does it? But anyway guys, I'm going out and I'll see you guys later. Hope you enjoy the carnage and fun of Grand Photo 5.